Okay, so here is my review of Monster Hunter World. So we're playing on PlayStation. We've been playing for two streams now, so probably about probably about 10-ish hours. And uh, this is my first time ever playing a Monster Hunter game. So my first like impressions is the game is gorgeous. Like you can just look around and see how nice it looks. And there's a lot of character customization. Uh, this is my character, and that is my pet. And my pet is very colorful and cute. Come here, Pikachu. Uh, so there's a lot of cool customization in the game, and the game is gorgeous. Um, being my first time playing, uh, you know, I was a little overwhelmed at first. Because, like I said, there's a lot of customization. There's a lot of stuff that you can gather in the world and use for crafting. But that's also, like, a good thing. There's a lot of depth to the game that I was actually impressed with because I, I just didn't expect it. I didn't know that you had, like... It's kind of, like, has RPG elements to it. Um, the, the monster hunting is a ton, a ton of fun. There's a bunch of different weapons and gear that you can use. There's, um, you know, different buffs and stuff that you can attach to your weapons and uh, just a bunch of different play styles based on what weapons you choose. So, um, I mean, overall, I've... I've, I've Borderline addicted to the game. It's really satisfying to get those kills. Um, you know, I think my criticisms would be that the controls are a little wonky, like kind of Dark Soulsy wonky. Um, like kind of the fighting kind of reminds me of that because you have to worry about the camera angle. You kind of get can get lost in the boss a little bit, and you have to manually um, look at the the boss because the lock on is is you know not not the best. Uh, the controls are just kind of like a little weird, but other than that, and I would say another criticism I have is uh, the monsters. You know, these fights are about 20 to 50 minutes long, and um, they, they might actually even get longer as the game goes on. I mean, I'm still super early, but the, um, the monster fights, it's like there's no really visual there's not many visual indications of like how much damage you've done to the monster there's no health bars which is fine but there's also no like there's not really any bleeding or like you know deterioration of the external visuals of the monster like you'll see the monsters limp sometimes and um it'll say like parts broken and stuff so that obviously gives you an idea that you've made progress but then the next second they are the limp goes away. It's like just a temporary thing and they don't really like bleed and look like shattered at the end. They kind of look like the way they started, um, which I think is, you know, kind of like, okay, I've been fighting this monster for an hour. It's like, I'd like to see it look like tattered when I, you know, murdered it. <laughs> um, but and that's just a minor critici criticism. Um, but yeah, so overall, I... Um, I really like it. It's been so fun so far. Uh, like I said, we're only 10 hours in, so this is just like a, a review of just like the early game stuff, but it's been addicting. It's fun. Uh, the kills are satisfied, satisfying, and uh, there's a lot of depth to what you can gather and uh, craft and stuff too, so it's really cool. Uh, so yeah, I give it a thumbs up based on my 10 hours of gameplay so far. I really do enjoy it. Uh, even if you're new to the Monster Hunter series, I think you'll really like it if you like challenging. Uh, games and that's another thing to note is it is multiplayer you can play with up to three friends so four people in total uh, but you can totally play the game solo you can have a, a complete solo experience without any issues um, it, the, the difficulty scales based on how many people you have uh, so you can play it solo it's fun um, it's challenging but it's not too challenging and yeah overall I, I do enjoy it so that's my review of Monster Hunter World. It's currently available on console and it'll be available on PC in the fall.